Angelina Jolie tested positive for a genetic mutation that makes breast and ovarian cancer extremely likely. And after the Supreme Court ruled the DNA test for those mutations cannot be patented, testing will get cheaper. That's good news for cancer victim advocates who worry about women who are uninsured. These tests, these life-saving tests, will be so much more affordable for all of us, regardless of how much money is in your pocket. The company Myriad Genetics held the patent for testing on what's called the BRCA1 and BRCA2 genes, charging three to $7,000. After the Supreme Court ruling, local company Pathway Genomics announced that it will offer tests on those genes and others will likely follow. It will you know, result in other laboratories that have the capability, like Pathway, to, to offer uh, these tests at a substantially lower uh, price point. Pathway Genomics would not say how much it will charge, but promises it will be much less than 3000 And women we spoke to like that idea. I absolutely think DNA testing is great for everyone to have access to, especially breast cancer. If it's cheaper, then yeah, why not be safe and get yourself tested? It's good to do it as early as possible, and if the funding is there and it's cheaper, then why not? With an estimated 40,000 people expected to die of breast cancer this year, Pathway Genomics hopes the effects of cheaper genetic testing will be profound. Uh, could potentially save many tens of thousands, if not hundreds of thousands of, of lives.